everybody, it's me, CRB. And I'm back with another video. So, let's just jump right into it. As you guys know by the title, I'm gonna be telling you my top Netflix recommendations. And they're in no particular order. They're just movies and TV shows that I've been watching recently. Um, that does include older shows and newer shows. Uh, if I do forget something, just comment down below if you have another suggestion or recommendation for anybody to try. So yeah, let's just get right into this video. throughout this video I will be putting up the movie or show that I'm talking about right here on the screen so that you guys you guys will be able to follow along with me or go look it up just to see what it looks like and yeah so let's go so the first show that I'm gonna tell you guys about now these are um, recent ones that I watched so I've watched the circle excuse me and that is a social media experiment but it was actually really addicting to watch and it was kind of interesting and i stayed up to like 12 watching it but they don't have that many episodes or seasons like it's only one season and it's not that many episodes so it's just like a quick watch but it's good if you want to go check it out um and then they also have a brazil version so i watched the u.s version i didn't watch the brazil version but maybe i'll go watch it if i feel like reading subtitles um, so yeah, now the next show that I wa recently watched is Love is Blind. Of course, everybody was talking about it. It was really good and I did really enjoy it. At first, I'm not going to lie, I did think that it was going to be like kind of <laughs> kind of stupid. I was like, oh, this is going to be so dumb. It's fake, of course. But I really did enjoy it. And so make sure y'all go check that out. And it's kind of like a, is love really blind? Like, can you date someone without physically seeing them first? Or can, can you have that attraction to someone? Um, but yeah, so make sure y'all go and watch that if you haven't already, which I'm sure you guys have, because so many people have been talking about it lately. Okay, so another show that I have watched, um, and this was a while back, was Once Upon a Time. And if you're more into Disney and fairy tale, that's the show for you um definitely go and check that out it's really good i stopped watching it though because sometimes they have a lot of seasons and they try and like drag it out so i was just like you know what forget it but it is really good um okay the next show is black mirror now, if y'all haven't seen Black Mirror, I recommend going to watch it, but it's just really weird. I can't even explain the type of weird it is. It's like, they do like crazy things, or it's not even that crazy. Well, yeah, it's kind of crazy. But like, the ending is something that you never expect or that you didn't want to expect or want to happen. And they leave it at that. So yeah, but it's weird, y'all. Okay, the next show it, that I recently watched is A Year in Space. Now that's for like sci-fi people and um, people who are into like the astronomy and everything. It was a good movie, well it's not a movie, it was a good show though, but it's only, it only has one season and it's like 11 episodes and that's it. And it follows one man specifically, but there is another guy with him that is spending a year in space. Um, I thought it was really cool, actually. Alright. Of course, this one, everybody knows. Um, the show You is definitely, definitely, definitely one that I recommend. I just don't like how... I didn't really like the way the second one was or ended, really. And I always forget how the first season of things went so i have to like go back and rewatch it and i hate how they take so long to come out with another season but go watch it if you haven't it's good i'm sure most people have though okay so another show that i recently watched um is self-made and that's basically telling the story of madam cj walker and how she became this millionaire 
um, by selling her own hair products. And yeah, that was really good too. Do, do, do. Okay. Let's see, is there another one? Oh, duh, how could I forget this one? Okay, so the last one that I'm gonna do for TV shows is the show on my block. They recently just came out with a new season and yeah it's really good i just watched it actually um i really enjoy it on my block i don't know if there's gonna be a season season four i really want there to be a season four but at the end of season three i'm not gonna say it because if you haven't watched it i don't want to spoil it but i don't know how i don't know i'm just leaving it there <laughs> okay y'all so now that we got past the tv shows um I'm going to go ahead and jump into the movies. Okay. So recently, this movie that I watched was so good. Like, you, I would recommend it. It's called Bloodfather. And it's actually trending right now on, or it was trending last week on Netflix. So, go watch that. It's so good. It's basically like an action thriller kind of movie, adventurous kind of movie. Um, and it's about a felon who met up with his daughter, basically, and she got into some stuff, and now he's in that stuff. That's all I'm going to say. I want you guys to go watch it, tell me what you think, and yeah. So, the next movie, and like I said, y'all, these are in no particular order. So, the next movie, of course, this is a really, really old movie, but I love Good Burger. I could watch it over and over and over and over again. Um... But y'all should go watch that if you haven't. <laughs> That's another movie. Oh, another movie that I really enjoyed. This is an older movie, but I really like the movie 21. It's about gambling and how these kids go to Vegas and gamble and cheat the system. And yeah, it's good. It's interesting. Okay, so another movie is Deuces. Deuces is a really, really, really good movie. I watched it multiple times at this point. Um, make sure y'all go watch Deuces. Okay, y'all, so another movie that I recently just watched that was really good was The Platform. I hated the way that it ended, but it's trending on Netflix, and I watched it, and it was good. I liked it. It's about like this prison basically that has a hole in the floor and they just send something through it. But you'll find out that something when you watch the movie. I don't want to spoil it. So Okay y'all so Life As We Know It. I watched half of it. That's another movie but it wasn't good enough for me to finish it. So I'm not going to recommend that one. But uh, I guess I'm done here, guys. Um, those are all my TV and movie recommendations. Again, I couldn't remember all of them. There are a few that I left off. Um, like, oh, another good TV show that you that I would definitely recommend is um, All American. That is actually on Netflix. I think they added the last or the latest season. So, yeah. That's a really good one. Y'all should definitely go watch that. Um, and that is all for now. I will see you guys in my next video. If you guys have any recommendations for me to watch, make sure to comment them down below. I do have more recommendations for other movies, but they are on like Hulu and Tubi and stuff like that. But if y'all want to know those, just make sure to like subscribe and comment and I will see you guys in my next video.